All right, everybody, Monkey Puzzle here. I'm just taking a little break in these groovy chairs after giving you all a little tour of this redwood bridge that I built on the Valhalla map on the YMC Arc server. It's a bridge in the redwoods between two giant trees adjoining to a third. It's also a base. Here's some of the stuff from that. And it is also a pub, <laughs> a nice place for people on the server to come have a beer or a refreshing beverage or get a little food, hang out and enjoy each other's company. So I've been working on this for maybe three weeks, three, four weeks. It's been a bunch of work. Had some help from my friend Aaron B from previous servers who has come join to help me with this. And I think it's at the point where it's just now finished. We're going to be inhabiting it for real, so it will develop further from here, but it was in the space where I thought it was time to show you this particular example of what we have done with some redwoods. Now, the redwood update for Vanilla Arc is coming out tonight or tomorrow, and there'll be some pieces in that that we did not have at this point that will latch onto the trees. So we had to create one that was basically freestanding, but the trick was to make it look like it was suspended in the trees. So toward that end, 
we've got these cables hooked onto the branches that are supporting it here and doing a little suspension thing here and then uh, let me go get a flyer and I'll show you a little bit more from the outside you saw it already but just quickly talking about what I did here so from the outside you can see we made it two layers thick that gives us a lot more surface area but it also gave it a appearance of rigidity rather than just having a single ceiling going across single ceiling thick we've got two layers combined with these cables and the fences the railings in order to make it look more like a truss more like something that could support itself all the way across the only connection to the ground is this one column here which holds a ladder that you can go up manually all the way and the thing that's actually holding most of the ceilings up up there is down here we created basically a land bridge supported by pillars that then allow the trick to suspend the ceilings up there because we have one set of walls going all the way up right there so and that is what makes that work that's a trick I've used before in some of my builds and it seems to work pretty well down here we have fortified it a bit with some stone because of course this is very vulnerable if this one column were to be taken out all of that <laughs> could fall down so not your best pvp structure but for our nice peaceful pve structure it's doing great plus we got all these formidable beasts down here protecting it we got a few of these gates these shorter gates that come from extra arc in order to uh, keep bad guys from coming in so we are modded here we are on the valhalla map obviously but i did not use any admin commands to spawn any of these items in they were all harvested by hand and with our dinos the harvest rate is five times on this server so not quite default but still a reasonable rate now if you don't want to climb all the way up that ladder to go up there or you don't come in on the <laughs> excuse me I'm talking here on the stargate that's up there that links to a bunch of different stargates on the map right now we were using that to come from our raft base which we had before this this is actually our first land base even though it's a treehouse anyway you can also get up there with this teleporter <laughs> that also comes with the stargate mod it's very very cool and it links up with the other one up there after a second and that's a great way to come up so I think that's most of what I had to show you let me see down below where I put the flyers you saw that's like a little hanger we've got a lot of the different crafting benches here we'll definitely need more storage as we go along and this got it nice and homey got our little fridge back there that has all our food and oh, left the stove on <laughs> to cook this is powered everything here is powered by a bulk arc reactor that's hidden oops, hidden way up there in order to not hear the buzz from it and then wireless crystals bring the electricity down here there are a few branches to protrude in I kinda like it um, but there was no one space in the tree that was completely free of that so we will just kind of accept that they go through the floor here but other than that I've mostly tried to really work around the tree and make it look very realistic. This structure here, I tried the thing where I didn't want a totally enclosed structure here because I wanted it to basically be open to the elements. Why make a beautiful tree house if you don't have views all over the place? So just enough, enough structure to shield you from the rain, but the climate up here has always been pretty mild so you don't need walls everywhere just enough to hold up the ceiling got some reservoirs up there so yeah looking forward to really living in this space I just wanted to show you all and see what you think so that's basically it I'm sure there's more stuff I should tell you that that's most of what I can think of for now if you have other questions or comments or suggestions ideas please leave them down in the comments below can see we've got all our utility dinos lined up here 
we send them through the Stargate over to another area for collecting resources so we don't destroy the natural resources around us here in the lovely redwood forest. And, oh, last thing I should mention, actually, is that this bridge was inspired by a contest proposed by Timmy Carbine for the YMC Arc members. That each month, we pick a build and we all try to work on it as we can. This month was a bridge. So, soon, I'm not sure exactly what the schedule is right now because it got changed a little bit. But soon other members will be releasing their vids of their bridges and it's up to you to choose which ones you like best. It's a competition and you guys get to choose the winner, but it's really about all of us just building cool stuff and showing it off for you guys. So also, if you have ideas about what we should build next, please let us know. And there were no rules for the contest. You could build it anywhere with anything. You could spawn stuff in. But I chose to combine it with my survival series here. So I didn't spawn anything in. And I should note too that even though I used Fly for one time to give you the tour, I did not use Fly at all to build it. So mainly built it on the back of Beatrice here or just uh, from the ground with my survivor. So that's it. This is Monkey Puzzle, and I'm signing out. Thank you for checking out the Redwood Bridge with me. I hope you liked it. And thank you for watching to the end of this spotlight. Bye-bye. <laughs>